what is unique about working in the fitness space from what you've done before and mm. also with this entertainment component to it this this game component to it what what have you found is unique working in this space with the way you're approaching it so yeah fitness Fitness is interesting, right? You asked, what is the plan for world domination? A thousand locations is one thing. But if you look at a lot of these new fitness ideas that come around, mm -hmm. like CrossFit started just 20 years ago, Orange Theory Fitness started mm -hmm. about 10 years ago. There's one called F45 that, that's very mm -hmm. popular right now. Those are all at about the thousand, maybe 1500 location stage right now. Uh, they all have about a billion dollar valuation. Orange Theory last I looked had a billion dollar valuation. Um, but what they struggle with, if you listen to their founders talk about the fitness space, is you have to avoid becoming a fad, right? How many times have you heard about various workouts that now you never hear about them again, yeah. right? And that's very common because people want to do something new, but if they're not getting results, if they're not, um, and really it comes down to that, if they're not getting results, then they end up sort of abandoning it, moving back to what they know, going back to traditional stuff. So you'll see the, the meteoric rise of a new fitness concept and then the steady decline down to nothing. Uh, so the trick is to avoid becoming a fad. All right, so what's Michael Trollin gonna do? Mm -hmm. And his team, because it's gonna take a team. What What is the Laser Tag Fitness team gonna do to make sure Laser Tag Fitness isn't a fad? Right, and I actually hinted at it a second ago. Uh, it's a great question, is the question for fitness business to answer. It is to give people results. If they feel like they are in fact seeing results, they'll keep coming back, like CrossFit, uh, their growth has slowed a little bit, but it's still increasing, mm -hmm. right? And the reason is, if you go to a CrossFit workout, everybody's got a six-pack. Everybody, you know, they, they'll show up to their workout feeling like they've had an awful day, excited for their workout because they know afterward they're going to feel like a million bucks. Those kind of short-term and long-term results are what keep that cult-like is what people describe uh, CrossFit. It's what keeps people coming back, uh, and community, actually which is uh, one of the great things about laser tag fitness with leagues and tournaments and teams, there's a built in community mm -hmm. that you just don't get at a normal gym. I think that's fantastic. I think you're, you're well on your way. 